Hello everyone! Today I'm at Bella Vita having breakfast with my sister. This was something I've been planning for a while but unfortunately was not able to get through. Finally it worked and here we are. I am Asma Siddiqui, the food fanatic and thank you very much for being here. I really wanted to have the pancakes because that was what I was craving for a while and that is what I had in mind when I decided to come to Bella Vita for breakfast. But by the time we arrived, it was uh, early afternoon and a little late to have something very breakfasty. So after looking at the menu thoroughly, my sister and I decided to order one starter, one main course and one dessert. And although I wanted to have pancakes for breakfast, we eventually decided to have uh, their bread pudding. We ended up ordering nachos a pizza for the main course and like I mentioned the bread pudding for dessert. For drinks I ordered the liver tonic which is the APC juice, apple, beetroot and carrot and my sister ordered the green apple ice. Because it was early afternoon there wasn't a huge crowd. We didn't have to wait for a spot and it didn't take forever for the food to arrive. The staff was courteous and helpful. Although I always have this fear of my order going wrong when the staff doesn't write it down. Fortunately, that did not happen. So we got whatever we ordered for and we got it timely, except for the dessert, which took a while to arrive. We had to wait a bit after we had finished our food for the dessert to arrive. And the staff came to apologize to us saying that they usually bake the pudding right at the end so that it doesn't go soggy. The nachos were great. My sister particularly loved them very much. I don't do this very often now but there was a time when I would always order nachos wherever I went and the nachos at Bella Vita are rated second after that of charcoal grill. But since the last time I had nachos at charcoal the quality has dropped and I'll have to rate the nachos de Bella Vita the best. The pizza we ordered for the main course was pretty average. It's not something that I will go back and order again or recommend others to have, but it was generally okay. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, I would suggest you do that because I eat out very regularly and I share reviews of my food outings with you. The bread pudding was the showstopper. It was served with a scoop of ice cream and it was the yummiest thing we have ever had. Had we known this was going to be so yum, we would have ordered more of it. And with that, we come to the end of this. I will see you next week. Thanks very much for watching.